The stretchy cast on for a sock Natalie. Make a slip knot and put it on your needle. Hold the tail end together with your needle so you don't accidentally use that to cast on. Don't ask me how I know. Now you put your right hand needle next to the stitch on your left hand needle, under the left, left hand needle. You take your working yarn and you loop it around the left needle to the back, around and through the middle and then you knit a stitch. Then with your right needle tip you go under the left needle, swivel it around and put the stitch from back to front on the left hand needle. Let's do that again. You see we have cast on two stitches. This cast on makes really nice pairs of stitches, so it's excellent for a two by two ribbing, for example. Put your needle under the left needle, loop the working yarn around the left needle and around the right needle, knit a stitch, swivel it under the needle, and put it on the needle from back to front. Again, put your right needle tip against the stitches on your left needle. Put it under the left needle. Take your working yarn around the left needle tip, around the back and back through the middle. Oops. Knit a stitch. Twirl your right hand needle under the left needle and put the stitch on the needle from back to front. Once you have cast on enough stitches, divide them in two and divide them over your two needles. We are going to unravel the slip knot by the way. So you don't have to count that as a stitch. Now, take it very carefully and make sure that your cast on stitches are not twisted. It's a bit of a hustle with this cast on, but the result is worth it, I promise. So take care not to twist. And then you can unravel the slip knot before you start to knit. Now you can start a knit to purl to pattern. When you have knitted all the stitches on the first needle, It is time to turn your work around, but then again you will need to check really careful that you have not twisted your cast on anywhere. After this it will get easier, but take really good care of it at this moment. I've knitted a few rounds to show you what the cast on looks like. It's just a simple knit to purl to cast on, but if you look at the top of your sock, it's really nice and it's also really stretchy. So I hope you like this cast on and happy knitting!